Now, if the news ever depresses you, um, I have just the thing to perk you back up, and it's uh, drugs. Because <laughs> this week, Denver became the first city to decriminalize hallucinogenic mushrooms. Yeah. This... This is going to change their whole approach to tourism. Denver, come stare at the wood grain on a door, then maybe take a walk around the neighborhood till you calm down. <laughs> of course, I've heard. I don't know. I'm not into that scene. I wouldn't know. That. I don't mess with that. I wouldn't either. know. I wouldn't know. I don't know the vibe. Of course, back in uh, 2005, 2005, Denver was also the first city to legalize marijuana. Yeah. It makes sense. <laughs> makes total sense. When you're high on pot, legalizing mushrooms seems like a great idea. <laughs> And then when you're on the mushrooms, they have to vote to outlaw the kaleidoscope of skull-faced monkeys that live behind your eyeballs. <laughs> but now, now that mushrooms will be decriminalized, experts say law enforcement must be trained to handle people having a bad trip. <laughs> sir, sir, I, I know you feel like you have a lot of hands right now, uh, <laughs> but I need you to pick two of them and put them on top of your head. <laughs> and no, my, my horse is not staring at you, because uh, that is a car. We got a great show for you tonight. Keanu Reeves is here. But when I return, we go on an adventure with Brian Cranston.